Yo, what's the deal, YouTube? This your boy MC6 Kicks Review coming at y'all again with another quick, quick detail review, man. Today we're gonna be looking at the Air Jordan Three. These are the Cyber Mondays, aka Oreo Threes, is what I would call them. Only thing difference, the only difference is these are posts of some Oreos, like the Fives. They don't have like no speckle in them at all, but they do still put you in the mind of some Oreo Threes, man. But starting out with the box, of course, like we always do. You got the Air Jordan Three Retro. Colorway is black, black, white. Price tag for these is $190. I grabbed these in a size 9. You've seen one Air Jordan 3 box. You've pretty much seen them all. You got the elephant print going around it. Nike uh, Jumpman with Air right there. And Jumpman right there. And bong, there's a shoe again, man. So let's go ahead and stack these, stack these joints up. Starting out with the sole, man, like we always do. You got a white sole. As you can see, you got Jordan right there, Jordan below. And then you got the stars on the toe box right there. Like I said, you've seen one Air Jordan 3, you've pretty much seen them all, man. Like I said, this is just a quick detail review, and I'm almost positive that there are ton, tons of reviews out there on these on, reviews on these on YouTube already. But like I said, I just want to drop some content on you guys today. I'm out of town on vacation, so, you know what I'm saying, just out there. I didn't even plan on copping no kicks, but let's go ahead and knock this review out. Yeah, white mid so and then the upper is black, and then the material on these, the leather, well, what I'm referring to, Excuse my language, man. Excuse me. Ah, I can't even talk. But the material on these, the leather, like I said, reminds me of the Dunk from Above uh, Fours, man. Dunk from Above Fours. So, leather is super soft, man. You got the jump in on the back, and then you got air on the uh, air behind it, as you can see. And then you got the other side of the shoe, man. Nice premium leather. Uh, tongue is black. So a smooth, light leather. I'm almost positive it's synthetic. Then you got the jump in in black. You got round laces. Uh, black sock liner, black jump man, and the sock liner, like I said, is black, and then the footbed is black also. And man, that right there is a shoe, man. Solid yet simple colorway, man. Like I said, if you're sleeping on these, man, don't do it. Don't do it. If the price drops on these, that's that's a steal. But uh, I wouldn't say a steal, but that's always good. Like I said, it's always good when you can save money. But I will cop these joints and uh, just hold on to them, man. Cause I, fit, I promise y'all, the same people that slept on them Oreo files, wishing they grabbed them. You know what I'm saying? Wish they had them now. Cause if you're looking for them now, depending on the condition, man, it's, it's you finna pay a little bit. You finna pay some some cash for them, man. Luckily, mine is still vintage dead stock. That's beside the point, man. But I just want to get y'all to understand that don't sleep on this shoe, man. Don't do it. Don't do it. I think it's a solid yet simple colorway, man. I wouldn't double up on them, and I don't believe in double ups unless it's a personal grill of mine. But uh, just want to, like I said, just want to drop a quick detail review on these, man. And uh, let me know what y'all think of the sneaker, what y'all think of the uh, silhouette. Pretty sure everybody's feeling threes. A certain, a certain select few heads out there in the game that don't like the threes. You know what I'm saying? But like they say, to each his own, man. But uh, enough of that random. Make sure y'all uh, subscribe to my channel for more reviews in the future. And I'll catch y'all on the next one really, the next one really soon. And it's your boy MC6 Kicks Review. Signing out. Peace.